okay this video is about to how to install netbeans and uh, use it for c and c++ first of all we have to download netbeans we will google it netbeans download and uh, here we will find um, there are lots of editions of uh, uh, which is java ee with java se html php these all are different uh, these all for different languages be supported and we will uh, download the all patch all in one pack download it it's of 221 mbs now this is i actually i have already downloaded it so it is downloaded and open the folder and here it is 220 mb click yes oh uh, it uh, it is asking for java se development jdk kit so we have to install it first open your browser search for jdk for netbeans enter download the file open the first site <coughs> uh, here we have to download the uh, first to accept the license agreement okay uh, and uh, here we have to download the windows version uh, if you are uh, using 32-bit uh, Windows operating system, then you download it uh, Windows x86. Otherwise, if you are using Windows 64-bit, uh, then download 64-bit edition. Otherwise, Linux and uh, Mac users can download according to their requirements. I am downloading 64-bit edition as I have uh, Windows 64-bit edition. Or if you want to check which uh, uh, operating system do you, do you have, you can uh, simply go to your my computer's property <coughs> click on properties right click and click on properties and here you will find a 64 bit operating system 64 bit processors okay okay now this form starts it's asking for to download and start downloading actually i have already downloaded it uh, this is the, the jdk 8u144 file 197 197 mbs and i am just double click it to install click yes i hope it would not take a very long time I am pausing the video here ok now click next next validating installing removing files copying new files it's asking for uh, where to stall choose the default C and program files folder once it is down uh, it is installed click close okay now we can install our netbeans 8.2 for windows double click on it or press enter it will give you the admin prompt click yes
click next accept the license agreement click next and uh, it is asking you to get to download just let it be and go with the, the defaults next i'm pausing the video here okay now our net b id has stored and uh, now we can run our NetBeans, uh, which must be on desktop. Here it is, NetBean ID start make a new project and Java application next taking longer than usual time mm, it may be for the first time okay uh, my first app okay where it will be safe no problem finish creating new project Now here we can start our coding. Oh. Hello world. It's actually loading. It is fully working. You can see that it executed the program and printed hello world. Okay, now uh, I will show you how to use C and C++ uh, in NetBeans. So in order to use C and C++, we have to install Cygwin. C Y G W I N dot com. Install Cygwin as I am using Windows 64 bit edition, so I'll download it Windows x86 64. Okay, actually, I have already downloaded it. There it is, so I'll install it from here. Click Yes, next, install from internet. Okay, okay, <coughs> okay. Now this is the complicated part, uh, here we have to uh, select a website, it basically give us uh, the uh, nearest uh, uh, websites uh, from we can download our installer package, okay, select anyone uh, uh, what you like, click next.
now from uh, uh, this selection we have to install gcc dash core we will search for it gcc dash core full and, uh, gcc dash core from this this is the gcc dash core and we will uh, do it from 5.3 version 5.4 and uh, we will install 5.4 ok and the next is G++ GNU uh, compiler collection uh, 5.3, 5.4 and we will go for 5.4 and make <coughs> this is the the GNU version for make utility 4.2 okay and G G D B and from this we have to install uh, 7.9 7.10 7.10 okay now that's it we have installed all the four requirement uh, features click next and it will take some time to install it will actually download the packages and install it there I am pausing the video here ok our sidewind uh, has been installed click finish ok now we can use uh, C and C++ we have first we have to check uh, is it correctly installed or not open the NetBeans remember that we haven't ch uh, changed uh, any uh, default settings all the uh, programs are installed in uh, default C uh, partition directories okay, go to tools options C and C++ click activate Okay, now you can see that if uh, uh, it has loaded all our sidewin directories, if it uh, it is not properly installed, it will not show up these uh, default directories. We have to give them uh, the directory roots from browse and go to C and where we install it C sidewin <coughs> and bin folder and then click open. As uh, we have uh, all, uh, it already fetched up all the infos, so it is properly installed, and we can uh, uh, compile our C and C++ programs. So we have to open it as a new project and click C C++ C C++ application. Okay, my C app. We will be using it as only C
go to my C app sources file and main dot C double click on it you will find the main in main I will just bring it to white so like this print f compile it build successful and uh, here you can see that hello world it's okay so it's we have perfect uh, correctly installed our side chain and net beans thank you